Seems like yesterday. Yes, indeed. It seems like yesterday. My older brother Fred and I were kids growing up on the Monterey Peninsula. Now, now we're both grandfathers living in two completely different locations in the world. Fred lives in Carmel Valley with his wife, Joan. He loves the valley with its panoramic views. He does a lot of sketching of those mountains. Although he has sketched one person that I know of, it is the mountains he focuses most of his artistic endeavors on. Whenever I come for visits, I always enjoy the walks with Fred. I am always overawed by the silence of the mountains, where all you can hear is the crunching of the footsteps on the gravel on the road. I live somewhere, well, somewhere noisier. Places, however, where you can walk under the trees and imagine you are hiking through the forest in some distant mountain. hardly ever escape the noise of the city. One day I was thinking about Fred and his paintings and about the silence of the mountains. What would it be like, I wonder, if I combined some of those elements with what I experience every day in Tokyo? So I sat down and tried my hand at developing what I call video paintings. I created three video paintings. The first one I call Carmel Sunset, Tokyo Sunrise. In it, I contrast the serenity of a Carmel Sunset with the nervous energy of an early morning in Tokyo.
The second video painting I call Lonesome Driftwood. It tells the story of a solitary driftwood stranded on the beach in Carmel. And the third one is an imaginary documentary about two brothers working on the same artistic project. I call that one Sunset in Fred's Mountain. 